Today I'm going to show you how to wake up your arch. What I mean is the arch in your foot. So you may have heard about people who have a flat foot and this arch on the inside of the foot is what they're referring to. So you can see I can get my hand in. Some people their foot will be so turned in, what's known as pronation, that this navicular bone will be pretty much getting close to the floor and there'll be very little room underneath that. So a good way to know if you've got a flat foot is to step on some water and then to step on some lino or on a tile and you'll see an imprint of your foot if your foot is the same shape as you can see here then you've got a flat foot so all of your foot is in contact with the floor if it's missing this part then that means your arch is supporting your foot and most of the weight is on the outside of the foot as it's meant to be and over the toes so I'll show you a technique you can do to wake up your arch. Now this technique is used by sports people and it's quite simple. All you need is a towel and this is called towel grab ex exercise. So with your foot you're trying to wake up that arch by contracting some of the muscles that cross the arch and getting the towel from one position to all the way to the other end of the towel. Uh, you need to repeat this on a regular basis as with a lot of mobility work it needs to be done on a regular basis for it to have long lasting effects and to benefit you so once you've worked into that you can repeat that several times but you want to spend two to three minutes doing this and you can do this a couple of times a week as part of your leg routine or when you're working on your mobility whenever that is in the day so I've marked a bit on the molecular there and what you can see now is when I put my foot, you can see a greater arch to if you rewind the video back and go back and how, see how it was before. The other thing you can do is if you push your toe, so when you're exercising, for example, if you're doing the squat, we all know that your weight should be pushed through your heel. But it's also very important to have your toe in contact with the floor. So if it's not and you're pushing through your heel, it's easier to flatten out your foot. If you push through your heel and your toe is in, in clear contact with the floor it's it's very very easy to support the arch while you're doing that movement so the arch move the arch shape is maintained so that's basic exercise on improving your arch